Hi, you guys, back here with Spray Omari, back with another video. And you already know we finna be speaking some real dope. You already know that's for sure. Everything I say on my videos is real facts, and that's pure point blank. How I feel, you know, I love motivating y'all because y'all are my people. Love y'all. We like a family, but I ain't even gonna call it a family, but we like a family. And I, I pay all my love and all my patience and all my time on y'all. I love making videos to make y'all feel good. and love making videos for y'all not to feel alone you already know so how was y'all day my day was good it was okay you know i ain't do nothing but went to the movies you already know but how was y'all day comment down below how was your day you know but before we get into this video like this video subscribe to my channel comment down below how you feel about this video because this video is very relatable because some of y'all need to know this like seriously some of y'all need to know this for real and some of y'all parents need to know this if you have a child if you have a niece if you have a nephew, they need to know this. Yeah. Matter of fact, play this video around your child. Play this video around anybody that's young, real young. Set a big example, for real. But further ado, let's get into this video. All right, y'all. So I'm not going to curse in this video because this video would be used for y'all personally to show y'all younger siblings, like your sister, your little sister, your kid, any child that's in your your you know in your household you need to show them this video you need to understand they need to understand too but i'm gonna be telling y'all like you see the caption you see the name you see whatever going on you see the thumbnail you see that and i'm gonna be letting y'all know watch what you teaching your your like your kids your siblings your sister anything watch what you teaching them watch what you teaching them like for real it could be the movies it could be what you're talking about. You like your child can be sitting over there while you talking to your your friend or something, and they can hear you. They got good ears, you know. But watch what you saying around your kid. Watch everything because you know they learn from it. Everything you say, everything you do, they learn from that. I'm serious. They learn that. They learn it. They keep it up. Like everything you do, you can be cursing around your child. It it, it doesn't affect it. It don't affect it right now, but as they progress to get older nine eight or seven anything they will start cursing like as a young age as a baby you know the child just start cursing like calling bees and all that and, and all that it's a reason they don't come like y'all i hate this i hate this y'all always say y'all make excuses y'all always say they come out the womb and then they start cursing no they don't come out the womb cursing they have to learn that they have to learn it y'all have to watch who Yo, kid around, y'all have to watch everything. You gotta watch what they that's why I say when I get when I get a child, if I ever get a child, which I'm scared I, I will, I'm scared to have a child and I don't wanna have a child. But if I ever like if God give me a child ever, any you know, I, I I might get a child when I get some money, like get rich. When I get rich, but you know, if I ever get a child I gotta watch what's going on in school. I don't want my child to go to school. I want my child to be homeschooled, be taught either from me or from what he's supposed to be taught. I want him to know about this life. I want him to know about everything. I won't curse around him because I don't like cursing around kids. I don't like cursing around kids. I'm a big role model. I love kids. I love kids, but if you get out of hand and you know, don't listen to what I'm saying, you know, I, I, I give you a little spanking, but, you know, I love kids. And, you know, I don't curse around kids at all. If I play video games, I don't curse around them. Like, seriously, I don't even play bad music around them. I hate that. Like, I don't, I seriously don't. I, I'm dead serious. Like, y'all don't believe me, but I don't play bad music around them. Like, for real. I play all good music, not cursing music. Like, anything that will affect their mind, I don't do it around them because, you know, as they learn from it, they learn from everything. Like, as me personally, I've been through their feet. I've been through everything they going through now. So I already know. So question everything. Question why is these kids cursing? Because they learning it from you. They either learn it from you or another sibling. You know? And as in school-wise, you know these kids, they get sent to school to get educated. They not ed getting ed educated. They are having sex in school and they are doing whatever, kissing all that in school. They doing all that in school. 
when they moms sitting in school to do what they got to do. But no, actually, they getting booty rubbed, they getting having sex in school, and they getting kissed on in school. So you got to watch what you send in your school to, I mean, you got to watch what you send your kid to school to do. Watch that. You can have a daughter. Watch your daughter. Watch everything. You should keep her homeschooled because it's scary. It's scary. Because you skinny sending your your daughter to school is scary because you know it's a lot of things that's going on in school. Friends, everything. Like she can be I mean, she can go in a wrong crowd and she can be having a little friends and them friends can bring her down all the way. I'm scared of that. I'm scared of that. So that's why I want my daughter to be homeschooled. I don't want my daughter to go to school and then fit in with the other kids or not fit in with the other kids and be talked about or be talked about. Like other dudes talking about her like, oh, she freaky and all that and all. I don't want my daughter to be around the school. I want my daughter to be home where she should be learning about the real, not the fake, not the things that's not even gonna matter in your life, you know? I want my daughter to be something in life, you know? So remember that. I don't want to curse around my daughter. I don't want to play nothing around her. The movies, the movies that y'all are watching, the movies that y'all putting on for y'all child is affecting their brains. It's affecting everything. Like me, I did this before. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I did this before. I played a scary movie around my niece and she was actually scared and she's scared of the dark. Why are you scared of, I understand it's a child, you know, they progress, but when they get out the womb, they don't act like, listen, they learn it. Like fear, fear comes out of nowhere. If you like, like, listen, listen, fear don't come when you automatically come out the womb. It got to be something that triggers fear. Got to be something that triggers fear. It could be the movie that they watching that can make them scared of the dark. You know, when you try to put them in their own bed in their own room in this dark time and they scared, they don't even want to get in their own bed because there's a reason. It's that movie that triggers them to for them to be scared of the dark or be scared of something popping out of their closet or anything. It's a trigger. That movie, that scary movie that y'all playing with y'all kids, it triggers the fear and it, it builds up fear, builds up a lot of fear and it's going to be hard to control fear when it comes to that real point. Where you like gotta go through it so it's gonna be hard to control fear as a child as a like you know until you progress I, I understand fear comes but you have to learn how to control your fear you know it's certain things you can be feared of but you have to control your fear you shouldn't be living on this earth living in fear you shouldn't be fear of anything like nothing is fearless like why are you living in fear why are you scared of everything like it's always that movie that scares you, like that triggers you to be scared of everything, you know? So watch what your child watching on the TV, you know? Just, just watch. Stop cursing around your child. Stop doing all in that because they learn from it. Seriously, it's in the long term. You think that they'll learn from it, but later on in life, you will see them doing what you used to do. I want my child to be better than what I was. I want my child to be better than me i know people don't be better than you know i just want my child to be good you know be better than me you know i want my child to be good for real and then i support my child by being a self i support my child 24 100 percent. i support my child i support everything about that child you know I always support your child I don't care what they doing, anything. Support your child, love your child. Don't never curse at your child. Don't never get mad at your child. Just calm down and tell them everything you do is gonna be a reason behind it. But listen, you have to teach your son or daughter right from wrong. You have to teach them that. I only wanna keep saying this because listen, I don't want to control you and control how you treat your daughter or your son, that's your son, that's your daughter, but I'm just giving you benefits. I'm just giving you benefits of what's gonna happen if you keep cursing around your child or keep doing anything around your child that can affect their mind because their mind is more powerful than anything. And if you do anything, it all starts in your eyes. Everything you see, everything you hear, everything you taste, 
it comes within your mind. It pulls up, it triggers your mind, and it makes some fear. It makes fear. It makes, like, it makes a lot of things. It triggers your mind, and it makes that child remember everything you did. And everything you did, they're going to do it too. They're going to remember it. I'm like, all right, I'm going to do it too. Yes, that's how it works, because I have a niece myself. I have a niece myself. I have a niece myself. And everything my mom do, my niece do it too. Curse. My niece curse. My mom curse. My mom curse. My niece curse. I never curse around my niece. I never play bad music around my niece. I never do none of that around my niece. I love my niece, but it's just certain times when she make me mad, but I never curse on my niece when she make me mad. I just give her a little spanking because, you know, I got to get it together because she don't listen sometimes. But bad things i see it and literally you cannot tell me nothing like literally do not correct me on this one because i personally paid attention to what's going on i'm going through it now my niece doing everything what my mom doing and she's the only one she cursed she's the only one seriously but it's okay though you know I, i'm not gonna judge the book by its cover she can get better throughout life she could do something different she can stop cursing anything it don't matter. I don't care. You know, I'm not even going to judge the book by its cover. I love my niece. I love all children. I love kids. You know, just change what you're doing around your, your kid. Like, seriously. Because everything you do would affect that child's mind. And that mindset will make them... That mindset will control their body set. Control them physically. And they will do the things that what their mind tell them to do. You know? Everything you do... It affects their mind, and their mind simply tell them what to do. It controls you. Don't let your mind control you. You should control your mind, you know? But, yeah, I just love talking about this word of wisdom, and that's for a fact. I always love your child. That's, that's just period. But, y'all, I love y'all so much. Keep this video in mind. Never leave this video away. Keep this video in mind. Show your child. Show anything about this video. Simply, we out. Peace.